everybody welcome back to my vlog today we are going to banff and it's so nice though i'm so excited so i'm just going to show you a few things of what you can do in banff and um, for the day free things as well and also stuff that you can pay for but um yeah we're gonna spend the day up there and it's so nice in summer i went last week and it's like a completely different place it's amazing i can't wait to go up now Driving to Banff usually takes about, I don't know, like an hour and 15 minutes maybe, but today it took us nearly two hours to get there because there was some traffic. And then when we got to the gate um, to buy our tickets, we were waiting there for like about 40 minutes because it was really busy. But then when we actually got to Banff, it wasn't that busy, so don't let that type of thing put you off because... When you get into Banff, there's loads of other places to go. They do, everybody doesn't just go to the one place. Obviously the first thing that's free to do in Banff is just walk around all the streets and go into some of the shops and stuff. The streets here are just so nice, like you could walk around them all day and just look in all the little stores and they're really cool. And even down some of the smaller streets are really cool as well, not just the main streets. So make sure you have like a proper explore of the whole area. we done which was amazing and i would definitely recommend it is we went to the upper hot springs and you can either drive up or get a bus from banff avenue which is only like two dollars and it leaves you right at it and it's eight dollars in and i think you can stay for as long as you want and if you don't have towels or anything you can rent them and stuff like that and um, but oh my god it's literally so nice for 
free as walk to Bow Falls. And there's a trail that leads the hallway just at the end of Banff Avenue there. And it's a really nice walk. There's lakes and stuff down there that you can go down to as well. And yeah, it's just really lovely. evergreen Yankee candle or something that smells like evergreen or forest it actually really smells like that in this forest it's so cool this is actually a garden you can go into but I don't think you're allowed to bring dogs but that's free Another thing you have to do when you're in Banff is get a beaver tail. They're these type of pastries that, I don't know, they don't taste like any pastry I've ever tasted before. Like, they're just so unique and they're amazing. And you can get loads of different toppings on it. I got the maple spread on mine with chocolate and oh my god, it's so good. <laughs> minute drive where you can get the bus for two dollars from Banff town and it's honestly like a castle it's amazing 
So you can drive up to the hotel, which is a five minute drive, but it also costs $10 to park, ten dollars to park your car. So if you don't want to do that, definitely get the bus for $2 or just walk up instead. But it's definitely worth coming up to. And you can also bring your dog in. It's a pet friendly hotel, so you're allowed to bring your doggy. <laughs> as well there is other hot springs you can go to and there's a place called the cave and basin which is like i think it's like a cave and um, with a natural hot spring in it obviously we couldn't go because we had luna but that is another thing that you could look into going to there's also the gondolas you can go on which they would cost a lot of money though i think it's about 70 or 80 dollars each and then you can also rent canoes and rent rafts and do white water rafting and stuff like that so there is lots to do but i just wanted to show some of the cheaper or free things that you can do like in the immediate site of banff town if you know what i mean <laughs> we drove to that was like a 10 minute drive from Banff and it's so nice I'll put the name of it here so you can see because I can't say it proper and that's the end of our day in Banff which we had so much fun we were there for like five hours and even though it looks like we didn't do much that five hours was still taken up by all the stuff that we've showed in this video and we are actually going on a camping trip now next week up to banff jasper and lake louise which is going to be so fun and um, we've never camped before so it should be funny and yeah we're going to be doing loads so make sure you keep watching my videos to see what we get up to and thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.